No matter where you were in New York City today, claps and sounds of celebration could be heard. From the moment Joe Biden was elected the 46th president of the United States. We've got to get this man out of office. I'm happy because I'm, I'm pretty sure there's going to be a lot of change and I hope what he says he's going to do, he's really going to do. Kamala Harris, now also the first female vice president. Her parents are Jamaican and Indian immigrants. We have just dumped Donald Trump and your days are numbered. As we have now made history three times in one. At the same time, a woman, a black woman, an Indian woman. Over a thousand people who have been wanting change since President Trump took office gathered at Columbus Circle, dancing and cheering. They then marched to Madison Square Park. It feels great, it feels important, and it feels unfinished. Because we got to get those Senate seats in January, and then we have to get the dollars we need to rebuild our city. I feel so relieved. Oh, my God. It's like so much stress has just been kind of lifted off me. I feel like the nightmare is about to end, and I can't wait for Donald Trump to leave. Public advocate Jamani Williams joined the celebration. Take a second to celebrate. Hit the streets. Peace. And President Trump did respond today. He says this election is not over. He does plan on fighting the election results in court. But in the meantime, New Yorkers who we talked with today who wanted to see change say they know there's still lots of work that has to be done, but they're going to take some time to celebrate. We are live at Madison Square Park tonight. Jennifer Bisram, Pix 11 News.